Hi, this is Jean Sharkey, and I am going to tell you about the book that I chose this week. Um, it is called The Midwife's Apprentice, and it is by Carolyn Cushman. Um, there aren't any pictures in this story, an exception of the um, cover, so there's no illustrator. Um, it is... Um, published by Clarion Books in 1995. Um, it is about 122 pages. And this book is actually probably more geared towards um, 13 uh, to 15 year old uh, students. Um, it talks about this girl. She calls herself Brat. She um, basically gets abandoned uh, in the beginning of her life. She doesn't remember her parents or um, anybody taking care of her or feeding her. Um, people aren't very nice to her. They call her mean names. She um, kind of moves from town to town um, for a while and um, tries to get food and places to stay. And one day she happens to... Um, stay at a midwife's and um, the midwife is actually not very nice to her and tells her that she has to leave um, but she actually works for her stay so she um, actually gets to stay and she feeds her for the work that she does and then she kind of um, watches her and learns the trade of becoming a midwife um, and, and so she kind of learns a lot. She kind of learns a lot about herself. Um, she, um, actually starts to learn about the midwife trade and by the end of the book is able to deliver a baby on her own, uh, which is really kind of cool. I think that the, the biggest part of this book to teach kids is, um, you know, to keep on striving and working hard for, um, what they want in life. Um, and, uh, as far as the, um, um, as far as the activity for this story, uh, since it is for older kids, uh, I would have them write, um, about a time that they worked hard for something, you know, if there's any kind of struggles that they went through or if they had any, um, conflicts that might have come up. Uh, while they were trying to work hard for something and um, just kind of give an example of, you know, what it was that they wanted to work for um, and their experience getting to that. Thanks. Bye.